I wanted to talk about a couple updates that I have of my just my routine this semester. Okay, I'm really craving a matcha and I forgot I had this from Kroger. I have this dress right here and then this is it in black. And I'm showing Caroline the Charlotte Tilbury Contour one. Here's my Booming Foods haul. Good morning vlog, welcome back to my channel. If you don't know me, my name is Daria. If you do, thanks so much for coming back to my video. Today I decided to pick up my camera on this last day of the week of the first week of school. Yeah. So I can just show you my getting back into my school routine as I try to navigate that myself. So I thought I would just take you guys along with me. I already got ready for the morning. I forgot that I was gonna vlog today. So I already made my coffee. I'm still finishing it up and I'm about to head to my first class but I am a teaching assistant for a class this semester, so I'm gonna go talk to that class first, and then I have my first class of the day. I'll show you guys my outfit real quick. It's not anything you haven't seen before. Sweater and jeans are from Abercrombie, and then I'm wearing my Air Forces, and I'm gonna throw my Aritzia puffer on top of it. I wear this outfit so much, but it's just so comfortable and so simple. And I just love it because I don't have to like put a lot of brain power into it and especially having to sit all day I just want to be comfortable. I just got back from my first class of the day. It's 11 15 right now So I think I'm gonna have a quick breakfast Something small because I don't want to eat lunch quite yet. So let's go make some food Okay, I didn't make it look that appealing today <laughs> But there's just two eggs and all those vegetables and some salt and pepper. And then I have this medium serrano pepper salsa from Target. It's not my favorite. It's a little bit too spicy, but it'll be fine. Okay, I'm really craving a matcha and I forgot I had this from Kroger. It's this matcha love organic and I made it once and it was really clumpy, but I have a little like hand frother that I'm gonna try to use instead. Wait, do I mix this with water and then add milk? Yeah. Ow! Yeah, okay. That's why I didn't make it right. Okay, I mixed it with milk, but you're supposed to make it with water first. Okay, so I'm gonna do half a teaspoon. put some vanilla syrup and some whole milk don't even come at me i like whole milk i drink real milk yes i do like soy milk sometimes but i'm feeling this okay i'm gonna try it 14 plus 12 is 30. no i mean 26. guys this is actually really good no 14 plus hmm. 12 is 26. I really would prefer some Wait. vanilla soy milk. 14 plus 12 is Just because I do like milk, but I'm kind of scared that it's gonna give me a stomach, <laughs> a stomach ache. You wanna try it? No, thank you. I don't drink whole milk. Okay. That's really that's really Yes, you do. Sometimes. Just try a sip. It's not gonna do anything. No, it'll give me bubble guts. <laughs> Just try it. No, I have gum. Here, I'll try it. You're really killing my vibe. Is this the packaged matcha? Yeah, but it's really good. Can I try it? Well, I don't want to try it now. It just tastes like milk. No, it doesn't. It's okay. It is a little bit milky, yeah. but it's, it's good. Okay. It's alright. It is very milky now that you say that. Carol, do you want to try it? No. Caroline would drink like a whole glass of milk. <laughs> she well, loves milk. Everybody's milks. telling everybody that, okay? I just said you I'm just a... told like 30 people the other day. I just said that I'm a slut for milk. <laughs> I don't want to try Caroline hates, 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 hates plant-based milk. She thinks it's... <laughs> what? Yeah, that's true. You literally want me to do a what Caroline eats in a day and I can't even talk about your milk? No, you can't, but... I support people drinking other milks, but also realize you're buying from a large corporation. It's commercially produced and there's so much water usage that goes into it that you're honestly... It's not even. So you and might as well just get it from a cow. But some people... Get you, you can, you just try a sip. You can buy. You don't do it from the straw. You can buy milk can that's organic a and it's sourced from a cow that's good. Or you can buy almonds that were fucking raised on a. <laughs> I know, but sometimes, like for me, for right, me, it's pretty good. if I have milk, I don't feel very good. <laughs> okay, well yeah, maybe that's I because might not feel very disgusting. Great after <laughs> 
<laughs> She's joking. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. I think it's like seven out of ten. Seven. Could use five. more matcha. I'd say 13. four. What's seven times four? Oh, four. four out of ten. Plus five, thirty-three. You just told me it's a four out of ten. Well, it's mint green, and matcha is supposed to be like green green. It's. I think that's like Wait, pretty much. Wait, what's seven pretty times five? Carol. Thirty-five. I think it's good. Do I make a backup plan for a backup plan? Do I? No. No, you don't even like making a plan. <laughs> Do I stay calm even under pressure? Do you what? Stay calm under pressure. No! <laughs> Absolutely not. At social events, I- Alright, here's my lunch. I'm honestly still not super hungry from that breakfast because there was so much protein in it. But the salad is super easy and it's like <laughs> kind of weird but it tastes so good. Caroline showed it to us. It's just romaine, parmesan, everything but the bagel seasoning, croutons. Cucumbers, olive oil, and lemons. And its name is? The Caroline Salad. I already. <laughs> I said you introduced it. Well, so I'm back from class. I'm all done for the day. It's 4 30, so I have two classes today and I have a pretty nice four hour gap. Yeah, in between my classes, so I have time to take a break and do some other stuff, which is nice. But I wanted to talk about a couple updates I have of my just my routines this semester, so. One thing I've started to do, which is my first week of doing and I absolutely love it, is planning out recipes for the week. So like you know, if you watch other vlogs, Donovan and I make most of our meals together and he's at my house a lot. So we just buy groceries together now and cook here. And so this week we planned out six different specific recipes for dinner time. And then we also just got some easy things for lunch. And we're, we don't like a lot of breakfast food, so we just got what we know we like. And it's so nice because I don't have to think about what I'm gonna cook. I just, well, I do have to think about it. I don't have to think about if I have the ingredients for a recipe I wanna make. I just know I have six recipes. I can choose from them and decide which one I wanna make. And so far, it's been amazing. We went grocery shopping Sunday night and it's now Thursday and I still don't need to go grocery shopping. And last year we would probably be running out of groceries by now. We did spend about 50 more dollars, but usually I would probably spend that eating out. But we did six recipes because we decided we were gonna go out once a week, which I think is a pretty good routine. Another thing is that I joined a yoga and Pilates studio, which I think I also mentioned in my last Vlogmas because I just felt like I wanted to do stuff with more just my body and not using a bunch of equipment. The gym here is absolutely insane. I went there yesterday for the first time to get a quick walk-in on the treadmill. It was so packed. I've never seen it like that before. So I am so, so, so happy that I got a membership somewhere else. And like I mentioned, I just am not in the mood to think about a workout at this point in my life. I just kind of want to be in an environment and have someone guiding me. I get so stressed out when I have so much school and obviously content stuff to worry about. So it's just nice to go in there. Someone's telling me what to do. I don't have to think about it. And I'm really motivated at the same time. One downside, I really want to go today, but I broke my wrist when I was doing ballet when I was like 11 or 12 and in my later years in life. I'm going to spend a couple hours doing some stuff for social media. The sun, I hate how early the sun's going down because I do want to shoot some content, but I have an hour to get that done. And mentally, I don't know if I'm ready for that. I kind of want to get some inspo first. I think I might do a night shoot tonight. I've been putting it off all week just because I've been so tired. But I'm currently trying to place my order for my Princess Polly collaboration. I have to pick out some items and I'm so conflicted. This happens all the time. I'm like, oh, I'll just do a really quick order, or find something cute. But then I like get stuck on the website and it takes me so long. So originally I was thinking to do this sweater with these pants. And then also get this like button up shirt, which I saw the last month of collaboration and I loved it. But I think I'm just gonna get these two because I already have pants that I can, oops, that I can make work with these two tops and maybe get a dress because I have to have two outfits. And the problem is they have so, so many cute dresses. And another problem is I love all of their black dresses. And so far I've only bought black dresses from them. 
but I just feel like that's what I wear the most so I'll probably end up getting another one but I just can't you guys know me I love my neutral colors I have this dress right here and then this is it in black and I'm really debating if I want to go ahead and get it in black as well because I love it okay I'm doing my makeup because I actually am gonna go shoot content and I'm showing Caroline the Charlotte Tilbury contour one because I just got it and it's why are you breathing on me it's amazing that much Why don't they have, do they have a blush? Yeah, but it was out of stock. Oh, I would get the blush, you see. Maybe I should. Okay, now watch. Two of them. What do you do with the other one? What do you mean the other one? I thought you got two. I'll show you. Is the other one for summer? No, <laughs> it's the highlighter. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Hang on, I'm still figuring out how to bund it, but it goes on so smoothly. Did you see that? I did see. But wait, is it too? <laughs> what? You're like a dog. Okay, I'm just gonna let you know that I'm like not performing right now. Like this is just me. Okay. Um, I'm scared because this looks so much. Hang on, let me let me switch my light setting. Okay, no, that looks like the lighter one wouldn't work on my skin. All this stuff you have, Jesus. Are you done yet? No. Okay, here we go. Okay, so this is the outfit I want to shoot in. This, oh, I haven't even talked about this on my channel. I'll get to it later, but I was supposed to wear this in New York and. My trip got canceled, so I'm gonna shoot it here. All right, we just like speed took pictures and Caroline did a really good job. I'm really picky about my pictures, but. <laughs> They're probably like, who the fuck is your roommate? <laughs> <laughs> I know, oh my gosh, my hair's a mess. But I wanted to talk about New York because I said I would mention, hang on, I'm like having a brain aneurysm. <laughs> okay, I was supposed to go to New York this week. I was supposed to be there right now. I was supposed to leave yesterday morning. And I am an apparel merchandising major, if you don't know that. So I was supposed to go for a class trip for my program. I was going with some friends from school and we were going to the NRF Big Show, which is by the National Retail Federation. So it's the Big Show and the student program. The student program got canceled, although the Big Show is still happening. It's just for students that already live in New York. So like FIT or NYU students. But I'm really upset because I was so excited about it. I mean, who doesn't want to go to New York? So like I said, this outfit I originally bought for there. Ooh, this, this golden hour is loving me right now. Um, But yeah, I was supposed to go yesterday through Martin Luther King Day, which is Monday. But unfortunately it got canceled due to COVID, of course. And as of right now, there's no reschedule for it. Okay, I forgot to record it before I started eating, but I made homemade pizza for dinner. The dough is the garlic dough from Trader Joe's. And then I just put mozzarella, <laughs> red onions, bell pepper, black olives, banana peppers, and mushrooms. Yeah, yeah, and it's really good. Okay, we're currently on our way. What that gotta do with me? To Blooming Foods, which is a local grocery store. It's like Aritzia, but for food and medicine. <laughs> Seriously. Aritzia is not local. Well, it's a conglomerate. Alright. Don't know what that means either. <laughs> Anyways, it's a local grocery store. Because Caroline wants to get some food from the deli. And I want an Olipop. I support local. We, we support local. We. We. Also, I just felt like I have to let you know, I do have a third roommate and it's not Donovan. <laughs> Her name's Izzy. I don't know why she's not in my vlog. She'll be in, the, she'll be in the next clip. Insert photo here. No, I'm not gonna insert a photo. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> I'll just show her in the next clip. Okay, Izzy, 
say hi to the vlog because hey, I, vlog. I felt like right before we left, I said that my roommates are not Caroline and Donovan. I actually have a third roommate named <laughs> Izzy. So this is Isabel. Right. You've never called I me never that call before. I never called you that, so it felt really wrong. I always second guess your real name. But this is Izzy, my third roommate. Here's my Blooming Foods haul. This is absolutely one of the most disgusting things I've ever had in my life. <laughs> and then I just got some kombucha. Have you guys had kombucha? Water? Yeah, it's weird. You're it's like, like so electric. I'm it's so to... bubbly. Mm -hmm. I don't, I've never had it, but George still like, makes it. Nose and eyes burn. It kind of tastes like beer, which I know it's it has. It's fermented. I know. Mm. This is the, I'm drinking the raspberry lemon one. It's not bad. Kombucha is just weird. I just feel good when I drink it. I'm all ready for bed, so I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video today and just getting back into the groove of school with me and hearing some of my routine updates and seeing a little bit more into my life. So if you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe and also follow me on my socials and I'll see you guys in my next video.